Hi everyone, it's Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.co and .com here in Lewis Beach, Delaware. This is a tutorial for Genos and Tyros, of course, um, on a little shortcut to saving OTS settings for a particular song. Now, I do have the step-by-step -step saving to OP OTS on the Tyros on my video lessons page and uh, this is going to be there's also one on genos on my video lessons page and by the way speaking of that a lot of you don't go to my video lesson page you go right to my youtube channel that's really a big mistake because you can really see what videos you should be watching in which order on my video lessons page and there's a wealth of information there and of course all the songs we do every week is there now we're doing i just called to say i love you this week in our song of the week in buttons class uh, which is going to air very shortly but i thought i would so show you some shortcuts to customizing the ots uh, for this song and any other song that you might want to do so let's take a quick look at what you're going to learn. Okay, so I pulled up in the style, go to Retro Pop, go to page two, and click on Wonder 8 Beat. Now, let's listen to what the Yamaha artists have told us would go great with uh, this particular style. The first one is a harmonica. The second one and let me exit out so you can see that screen, is a C7 Pop Grand and DX production. The third one is a synth fusion lead. And the fourth one has New Heaven and Sky Bells as a so uh, sound. Now, what I want to do is customize these a little bit because they're not exactly the way I want them. The first thing I'm going to do is on this four, uh, right, or on the three, where they have a fusion lead here, I'm going to take that, I'm going to go to page 11, and I'm going to put my sub lead on. And that's more of a Moog synthesizer sound that uh, we had in the old days during that time period. So I like their setting, but I just want to improve it for me. Now it's on three, and I don't want it on three. I want it on four. So I'm just going to hit memory and four. Now when I do that, of course, you've seen my uh, setups to one touch. It says the date has been changed, and you want to just put yes here and you're going to want to save here and it says wonder 8 beat and basically i'm going to delete that of course and put i just called to say i love you in there okay so i already have the style saved i just called to say i love you and uh, you can watch that on my ots video and of course the sounds are the standard Yamaha sound so I'm going to go back to this three again hit this fusion lead go to page 11 choose sub lead and I'm going to hit memory four and it says one touch setting has been changed yes I want to save it and I'm going to save it right there I just called to say I love you so save here you see the title comes up, press OK. Already exists, the title already exists. Do you want to overwrite? Yes. OK. So I just moved the third one, altered it a little bit, and put it on four. Now on one, I'm going to keep my harmonica there. But if you want a little more reverb, you can go up into the menu, hit the voice edit, and go on to your reverb depth here and raise it up to where you want it. And I put it up to 35 and I'm just going to hit memory one. And of course it says the OTS date has been changed. You've seen this before in my video. Save here. OK. Overwrite. Yes. And that's saved there. Now on number two, the sounds they had on there were the C7 Pop Grand and the DX Production. 
So I'm going to pull up my C7 Pop Grand, and I'm going to change that. I'm going to go to, uh, let's see here, uh, let's make it interesting, and let's choose the CF Concert Grand, or how about the Cocktail Grand? <laughs> That sounds really good, so I'm going to hit memory and two, go through the same process, one touch has been changed, yes, save here, I just called, yes, okay, overwrite, and I'm there. So now I only have to change three to whatever I want that to be. Okay, so what I've decided to do, just for tutorial purposes, is put my harmonica back on. <laughs> And that's got my reverb setting and everything in it, too. I'm just going to hit memory and three and put the harmonica in two places so that when I play this song, I can just use my OTS link button. When I go through my variations, it'll change the sounds the way I've edited them. Okay, now another way to do it, uh, that's one way to do it by hitting the touch screen there, but you can also do it through the voice select. So if you put right one, you can see that's the sub lead, right two is the DX padded, and maybe I want to change that DX padded to DX bells. And maybe I even want to adjust the volume levels on that. So I can exit out, go into my mixer, and there's my right one and right two and hit my pan and volume and there's my volume controls for right one and right two that I can adjust just by touching the screen. Now once I've done all that um, I'm going to go back to one touch one here and uh, choose my correct intro which is going to be intro two variation A is where I want to start and sync start is on, I'm just simply going to touch memory and one. And that's already saved. Now, since I filled up my first 10 already, I've got this setting, which is going to be in bank two. So as you go through the banks here, you can see it says bank two up top. If I go to bank one, just by hitting my left bank button, my original uh, settings there and I'm going to save this because it says the current registration bank has been changed. Do you want to save? Yes I do and bank 2 is there. Save. Bank 2 comes up. OK. Overwrite. Yes. So now all my settings are right here uh, on number 1 and if I go to bank 2 now on number 1 on bank 1 I have Misty but if I go to bank 2 and press 1, I just called to say I love you comes right up there. Okay, so now remember if you have a Tyros, go to my website and go to my uh, Geno's Tyros video lessons page and you can see saving to OTS step by step for the Tyros where you can do the same thing there. And of course, uh, tomorrow I'll be uploading I just called to say I love you for those of you uh, who are uh, part of my book bundle group. I'll be emailing out everything to you and of course doing all the settings for the song and having a little bit of fun with it. So until next time, this is Mike Mixon from KeyboardAmerica.co and .com here in Lewis Beach, Delaware. Say have a great day, keep playing, and see you soon.